Welcome or welcome back and I need help at C squared. In this problem, we're going to factor out an algebraic expression containing trigonometric uh, expression. And we notice we have two of them, sine and cosine. So sometimes you can change and have only one. And in this case, I'm going to use this Pythagorean identity, sine squared plus cosine squared equals 1. And we can solve for cosine squared here by subtracting sine squared and we end up with cosine squared equals 1 minus sine squared. Okay, it's a very useful form of this Pythagorean identity. So now we're going to go back here and we're going to replace cosine squared with 1 minus sine squared. Then I'm going to eliminate the parentheses. And I'm going to simplify. And we notice here the minus sign and minus 1. And I'm going to arrange them, let's call it in a standard form, from the largest exponent to the smallest. Okay, so this expression you see here is the same of the original one, but it's better because we have only sine of x in it. So the question is how I'm going to factor out now. We can use a substitution, y equals sine of x. And we end up here with what? y squared plus y minus 1. The question is what is the factor form of this expression? Okay, minus 1. Okay, so I think this is the factor form. Well, let me double check. Y squared minus one. Yep, yeah, that, that's no, that does. Oops, this is minus two here. Minus two. Okay, so this is the form. All right, so the final answer in our case will be we go back and we go back to this substitution and we get sine of x plus 2 sine of x minus 1. And this is the answer for our problem. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to click the like button and come back and see square for more help. Thank you.